All right, the ladies in black are ready. The ladies in black. <gasps> oh. Wow. Two hundred and thirty-eight thousand seven hundred and ninety-eight dollars. Wow. wow! And I know the Mid Ohio Valley probably has more to give. I think they do. We still have about another thirty minutes. Mm -hmm. So let's yeah. make it count. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah. We have tons of people so. still to thank because I know the top row has been on the phone the entire yeah, time they've been yeah. here. So yeah, we'll get to that right after the break. impact you can see right here at home. Wood County Society continues to be a vital resource for so many. Please help us as we work to raise crucial funding today. Your contribution impacts 19 programs and resources for youth and adults with disabilities in our region. Programs like Camp Echo, Summer Speech, Art Beat Studio, Autism Connection, and more. So please call or text your donation. Rise up for the Wood County Society today. Together, we can make a difference. A special thank you to our Collaborating Impact Sponsors. Wood County Society is rising up for an impactful year ahead. Camp Echo June the 4th through the 8th at Cedar Lakes in Ripley is a phenomenal cultural and respite experience with art therapy, experiential activities, equestrian therapy, aquatic therapy and swimming, entertainment, inclusion and relationship building. Summer Speech will serve area youth by reinforcing and improving the speech skills they've learned. Your support to Wood County Society enables us to provide these educational, therapeutic and respite care programs. Rise up today and make a difference. Wood County Society makes a difference in our community by providing unique American Red Cross certified adapted aquatic classes to assist individuals with aquatic exercise and swimming lessons for youth with Down syndrome and by sponsoring American Sign Language beginner and advanced classes throughout the year. The community can gain enhanced communication skills with American Sign Language. These are just two of the many programs funded by Wood County Society, rising up for all individuals with intellectual and developmental differences. A special thank you to our Collaborating Impact Sponsors. Okay, hey folks, I am back. Our last hour, actually it's way too quiet on set, but <laughs> might as well... <laughs> Might as well take a take this opportunity. Have our longtime board member Courtney Rogers here with Highmark West Virginia, and I see some love. Yes, yes. Um, you know we are pleased to uh, you know provide this donation today. As a board member myself, I'm kind of wearing two hats today, but I can say that I've been here for eight years, and to see just the growth from where we started to where we are, um, it's it's amazing, and we're pleased to be a longtime supporter and continue our support in the future. Every year you guys show up and it's just, again, seeing all these organizations show up every single year, it's just amazing. Amazing. I love it. I love it. Courtney, so great to see you. Yeah, thank you. Thank okay, you. Okay, okay. And last hour, power hour, where should I go? Oh, it's Phyllis. Hey, Phyllis. Hey, hey. I was just chit-chatting with Jay the Janes over there. <laughs> Yes. So let's see. Rhonda, is she on the, she's on the phone right now. I'll try to get to Karen. Karen, you've been busy. Hi, Phil. I certainly have. And I have a hello to you from Mike Lorenz. So hello. Oh, Mayor Lor oh well, yeah. former Mayor Lorenz, but that's how I always think of him. Um, and and uh, Joyce and Mike Lorenz are Archangel donors, so thank you very much. And I have some angels that are among us. Marvin Edwards making me a pizza. I have uh, Tony and Anthony, or Tony and Tammy Belcher, and uh, Larry Arnold from our Rotary Club, and several Rotarians from Belpre have called in. And I have Arnie Green, also an angel, so thank you very much. Thank you, Karen. And I still have not gotten a chance to talk to Ryan on the phone yet because he is so busy, but I'll check in with Jennifer. Jennifer, do you have any more pledges? Um, actually, I just gave the last one. I didn't get their name. I'm sorry. Oh, that's like, all right. Didn't write it down. All right. Well, we will check back in with you in a little bit. So I'll head over to Kiki. Kiki, do you have any new pledges? Uh, yes. Yes, I have one from uh, all my, uh, the beautiful and uh, 
very thoughtful Easter Parade Committee. And thank you very much, ladies, for your gener generous donation. And I appreciate it very much. And thank everybody else that helped and uh, make this place uh, wonderful. Thank you. All right. <laughs> thank you so much, Kiki. So I'm still waiting for Rhonda and Ryan to get off the phone. So I'll throw it to Jane now. Phyllis, Mrs. Whitaker, do you have some more folks to thank? Why, yes, I do. I had to look up what a group of angels was called, and it's called a chorus. So I'm going to tell you a chorus of angels here. <laughs> um, Bob and Debbie Newhart, or Newell, I'm sorry, Debbie uh, Board, uh, Steve and Patsy Hardy, Jim and Janet Staten, uh, Ann Biddle, Doc Frank and Lynn Schwartz, uh, Jim and Judy Bennett, um, Louie and Linda Molinaro, and Cindy Hemingway, and Mary Jeeves in honor of, or in memory of Dr. George Jeeves. <laughs> Thank you. That is quite a chorus of angels. You're right. <laughs> Okay, and Mom, you have some more folks to thank. Yes, um, um, I would like to thank Kinchlow Motors. They were a partner inclusion uh, for um, the Wood County Society. Um, I, Archangel, I'd like to thank Gary and Stella Moon. And Angel, Judy Perry. And guess what? She goes to our church, Jane. And, uh, and there's another angel, Karen Mitchell. And Karen Mitchell goes to our church. Hi, Karen. And here's Robert Hay, and he's an angel. And then my friend Sally Morgan, she is a guardian angel, and she's been very loyal to the Wood County Society for a long time. And also, um, Karen Mitchell, uh, her angel donation was in memory of her husband, Randy Mitchell. Yeah, that was very nice. And then also, let's see here. I had um, a lady by the name of Whitney Jones, who lives in Nitro, West Virginia, and she called in a nice donation in memory of a friend of hers, uh, Glenn Guinea. So we thank them all for all their donations, and what we are able to do with the money is phenomenal. Thank you all. Oh, my gosh, yes. Um, our cousin, um, Tom Wolf. He phoned in a wonderful donation. Uh, he lives in Texas, Plano, Texas, but he did not forget us. So we thank you, Tom Wolf, for your donation. We will do great things, I promise. Thank you for being here. Thank you. We'll be back around, and we're going to get on to Andrew on the front row. Hello, hello. There's been a battle going on. I'm a little afraid for my safety. I'm concerned for my safety. I oh I know I heard I heard you say something. Now, wait a minute. my friends right. <laughs> we I don't I don't know. Maybe this was Brandon Schwartz. Who put them next to each other? Who allowed this? Okay, first of all, I want to thank my dear dear friend. Oh, I've got this uh, messed up. Um, okay. Robin, oh Robin Roberts, she's our angel for $100. God bless her. Myra Toothberry is an angel. Um, now Higgins of Roscoe is an angel. And I just got a $25,000 pledge. Thank you, Kathy Azar. <laughs> Give a round of applause, everyone. That's great, John. You're doing great work here. Thank you to Kathy. That means the world to all of us here. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Well, well, let's get to Victoria now. What, what's going on with you? He, he might, he's gonna beat you now. Stop that. He's gonna beat you now. I, I said I should have answered the call before, and I should have. But I know you, I definitely even he's seeing you on the phone. So you got a couple more people to I shout do, out. I want to say thank you so much to Sheila Johnson, Wendy Johnson. Sheila not called once, but then she changed her mind and added more and called me back again. Mm. Um, my husband, he knew um. he'd he'd better call. <laughs> yeah, it, it could have been bad. Um, just saying. Um, Janie Ott, and um, yeah, that's where we're at. I need my phone to ring, and my number is 304 295 0797. I need people to stop calling John and call Victoria. <laughs> you guys heard it here. Call Victoria, not John. Now, we'll come back in a little bit. We do have a video about Camp Echo, and then we'll talk to the rest of the side here, but let's check out this video.
Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the Wood County Society Telethon. We only have about 15 more minutes left, so we're going to take a look at all the money we have raised so far today. I love drum roll. It's my favorite part. Whoa! Wow. Wow. wow! Andrew, read that number out loud. $79,893. Wow. And we've still got 17 minutes and about 15 seconds left to be exact. <laughs> so let's get to 300, Mid Ohio Valley. Yeah. Let's do it. Come on. Start calling these phones. I don't want silence. Let's get to it. <laughs> Callie, we're coming to you. Start with number one down there. Let's, let's go. go. Bring up the okay, energy. Andrew, first time. I love your energy, dude. Let's okay, go. Miss Michelle. Okay, we got an angel donation from Joe Davis at Sound Exchange in memory of Todd Stuby. Very, very cool. Um, thanks, Joe, for that. Um, we got a generous donation from George and Becky Betts. Um, we got a generous donation from Charles and Lynn Lowe. Um, another generous donation from Judy Johnson. Another generous donation from Gary and Susie Woodard. Mercy, mercy, my fam and Marietta, I love it. So we just got a guardian donation from Kathy Piles for Kirsten as well, which is really exciting. Um, we have angel donations from Dolores Gubert and Desiree Andrews, and then one of my shop friends in Indiana, Beth Lewis from Old Time Marketplace. So that's All the way from Indiana? Indiana, yeah, she wanted to call and support. So I love your tribe, guys. Okay, my Marietta shops. Let's still challenge them because there's so many shops in Marietta. Okay, so Charlie is at 304-295-0792. And Miss Michelle is at 304-295-0792. Amazing, amazing business owners in Marietta. Call. We got it. We got right. you. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do this. Let's do this. Another small business owner. Guys, anybody to thank? Got, uh, we want to thank another uh, donation giver here of Dinah Reader. So thank you so much. And again, you guys have a huge following. Let's make their phone ring. 304-295-0794. Last 15 minutes here at Telethon. Joyce, you got something? I don't have any since the last time. But make my phone ring. 304-295-0796. All right. Let's keep this room buzzing. I'm not surprised. Andrew, do you want to take it over for this other half? John, John, John's making it rain is how he said it earlier. He's he, he he's doing that right now. I. Oh, absolutely. There's been a couple people today. I've honestly felt almost uncomfortable being in between them. I'm scared for my own safety. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate that. We've been trying to get Lauren all day. She's on the phone again. That's a good thing. Rachel's on the phone. Now, everyone's on the phone. So, John, we're coming back to you. I have a lady in Marietta, Ohio, Ada Castro Melly, Melly, I think, um, pledged a hundred dollars, and she challenges all other hairdressers to donate a hundred dollars. Um, and I thought that was a memory of someone. I'm sorry if I mess it up. And I have another partner in exclusion, my dear dear friend Susan Ross. That's all I have right now. All right, and what's your number again so we can get My people number is 304 295 0798. Thank you. This is the man right here. You better start calling him. Lauren, we haven't gotten to hang out with you all day, so we're going to ask you just we've been asking everyone else. Why are you here today? Why do you want to be a part of this? Why should people be calling that number and giving you their money? I'm here to support the Wood County Society and make sure that everybody gets the love and support they need in our community. Absolutely. And so I know you have some names because you have been on the phone a lot. So feel free to share with us who, you know, give them a shout out. All right. So I have a bunch of angel donations. Uh, Jim and Trish, Trish Misikovich, um, in memory of my grandparents, Everett and Liz. Um, I have one from my uncle Lee Waggle, also an angel donation. I have an angel donation from Bev Eastup. I have an angel donation from uh, Fred Davis with Davis Athletics. Um, I have an angel donation from John Six, um, my seat partner here. Uh, I also have an angel donation, um, an or excuse me, or a donation from Janie Ott um, and money from Eleanor Six, John's mother, in honor of my mom, Bev Eastup. I have some other donations from Marcia, Marcia Myers and Mike and Sandy DeRose. And I just got one from my dad and stepmom, John and Jackie Eastep. So, well, that's beautiful. I'm rolling in. I'm very excited. You do have them rolling in. Let's keep it rolling in. We've only got 13 more minutes here, a little less. What is your number so people can reach out? Because your phone hasn't rang for the first time in a while now. 304 295 0799. Give me a call. Beautiful, Lauren. Give her a call.
I want to say I was going to try to get to Victoria, but it looks like she's busy. Everyone else we haven't talked to in this row, busy. Who do we got here? Come on. Joyce, what's your number? Come on. I, need, I haven't seen you on the phone in a bit. 304-295-0796. Perfect. And why are you here today? You know, what makes you want to help out the Wood County Society? Um, they have all kinds of benefits uh, for Wood County, and uh, they have 19, I believe, uh, benefits that mm -hmm. supports Wood County and other counties, and uh, it's a wonderful it's a wonderful um, organization. Yeah. yeah it's a wonderful organization. Absolutely. Yes, yeah, for children of all ages. And it's just, I'm blessed to be here. I, I am here working uh, for the Wood County Society. Well, that's beautiful, Joyce. People, make sure to call her because she's here for all the right reasons. Love your outfit, Joyce, today. Great, great color. But we're going to send it up top now. Phyllis, get to our girl Kiki Angelos <laughs> over there. Well, oh, she's on the phone. Oh, you know. Well, you know what? Love, I'll, it. love I'll, it, Kiki. I'll talk to Rhonda. I haven't gotten to talk to her yet. She's got a lot of people. Hi, Rhonda. Oh, hi, Phyllis. Thank you very much. I have some special people to recognize here today. A shout out and a thank you to Patty and Stan Minx, Mike Bunting, Matt and Shauna Alloway, David Hornbeck, Mark and Dreema Sook, Linda Weigel and Daniel Ward. Brooke Poling and Anthony Zarati, PRC appraisers, and a very nice uh, guardian gift from Charlie and Morgan Taylor. So I want to thank all these great folks. Okay, thank you, Rhonda, so much. Karen is on the line again. I was going to try to catch Ryan, but he's also on the line. So now I'll head it down to Callie. Wow. Before, <laughs> let me just keep on making everybody wait. Before I announce who won text to donate, shout out to Mr. Rudy for serving on your birthday. Happy birthday, sir. You are welcome. You're welcome. Okay, folks, I just want to give a true shout all of these students who came up and show up. I'm going to move so you can see actually everybody who showed up today to take donations for Wood County Society. It's so, so important and very meaningful. I mean, these guys are teenagers, so let's face it, spending an hour with us, they probably didn't want to really want to do that. There's more cool things to do, so I'm very proud of them. Okay, third place. We ready? PHS. Congratulations. Okay. So it was like so tight. First and second place was really, really tight. I'm learning that it came down to like literally seconds. So that's quite, quite impressive. Jackson Junior High with the second place. <laughs> and congratulations to Williamstown, guys. We were literally like dollar amounts away. So thankful for you guys. Congratulations, Williamstown, for winning it again. So thankful to have you guys. Big round of applause to everyone who donated today to our text to donate. Thank you, thank you, thank you for you all. And I so, so appreciate you guys. Last hour, it's way too quiet in here. Still, still, still. Andrew, how's it going over there? It's going pretty good. You know, we've got some people now off the phone here, which is not a good thing, but they've got some shout outs that, you know, they want to share with people. So, Rachel, we're coming to you. What you got for us? Okay, I want to shout out to Erica Watson, Karen Blake, Beth and Shannon Hall. Um, we have two angel donors, Andrew with Scout MOV and Carol Hildebrand, broker of Scout MOV, our angel donors. Robin Jen Morrison, Greg and Paula Hildebrand, Debbie Jackson, and Ben Bradley. Perfect. Thank you to all those people who have donated today. Now, I want to ask, too, what is your phone number? Yeah, you're giving the call me sign. Yes. 304-295-0801. Call me. Give her a call. She's waiting. I don't see a phone ringing. Emily and Brett, how are we doing now down here? We got some more names? Yes, we do. We want to shout out Doug Cummings, Amber Shears, Jeremy Caton, Caitlin Thompson, and Cassie Nesselro. Thank you guys so much. That is awesome. Now, I want to ask to phone number for everyone out there. 304-295-0802. Keep it ringing. They must see us talking. You got you to gotta, gotta call them ringing in right now. All right, we got Victoria West on the phone again. John, she My might... Phone hasn't rang for five minutes. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> five, five whole minutes. Three, come on, you better hurry, hurry. 304-295-0798. 
You guys have eight minutes left. Eight minutes. Give John Six a call here. Lauren, come on. Maybe one more time. This might be the last time we get to, you know, All shout right. out everyone. All so. right. My latest shout out is Connie Simonton. Thank you so much for donating. Someone give me a call. The phone number is 304 295 0799. Go, Lauren. Absolutely, Lauren. You're doing a great job. Jane, we're going to send it over to you now. Absolutely. We, we, Thank we you. We got some quiet phones behind me here. Come on. Hey, we have a lot of folks to think, I think. Sure. Okay, my phone just rang. Okay, I have a couple guardian angels to thank at Parkersburg Academy of Medicine and Mulberry Lane. And I'd also like to thank Dr. and Mrs. Um, Mike Shaw. Also, um, Sheila Allsworth, who gave a donation in memory of Rick Allsworth. And Shirley Lockhart, uh, Jeannie Kirkendall, and Linda Chancy. And I think, oh, and the Unicorn Wine Guild. Oh, okay. Thank you so well, much. You can get it. Absolutely. Jennifer's busy again. Ryan's busy again. I think that Karen probably has some folks to thank, Phyllis. Shout out to. I have a group of uh, really good buddies, Barb, Sean, Gail, and Vern. I'd like to make a shout out and thanks for the, for the donation. Uh, Dr. Lori Hawkins, uh, Smiles on the Boulevard. Uh, Make a Mia Pizza's Marvin Edwards for the, for the donation. Uh, Arnie Green is an angel, as well as Tammy White is an angel. And I have Robin Ambrosie and Ruth Coons, uh, some friends from uh, St. Ambrose Church, Lynn Pierce, Becky Hennon, uh, Amy Seabolt, a uh, good buddy from uh, Belfry Area Chamber of Commerce. So thanks so much from uh, my friends from the chamber, from my school district, and uh, my church. Thanks very much. All right, thank you, Karen. And Rhonda, I'll get back to you in a moment. But first, we're going to check out our total. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Oh! We're close, Billy. Yes. yes. So I think we're, we can we're keep going. $9,000 away from 300000 And you asked for yes. 300 right? I did. Mid-Ohio Valley, six more minutes. Yeah. Let's, yeah. Start those phones. let's go. Yeah. Let's hit that 300000 mark. Come on, let's do it. Okay, yeah. I have some new donations. Miss Joyce, real quick, what do we have? I have an angel donation um, from Ann Kavarik. And it is a memory of Cassandra Ringer, as well as her husband, John Kavarik. What an honor. What an honor. Yeah. Okay, let's make Joyce's phone ring. What's your number, Joyce? 304-295-0796. Okay, last hour, last couple minutes, actually. I lied. Okay, Pam, let's yep. go. I've got a few more. Uh, so I have an angel donor uh, for Donna Campbell in memory of Bill Campbell. Um, I have another angel, Creel Properties. Um, making me a pizza, Marvin Edwards is another angel donor, and Sandy Hintz. Okay, wind down, folks, folks who love Miss Pam and her organizations. Let's give her a call. What's yes. Number, Pam? Uh, 295 0795. <laughs> give me a call. Okay, folks. Jim and Tina, Eva, I'm so sorry. Any, any new business? Mm. Not yet. Our phone is waiting. Okay, okay. I know my clan from Marietta has some new business. What's up? We've got Rick Metz from Metz Cleaning Service and Sherry Adams donated to both of us, yeah, both which of was us. really cool. I know, right? Yep. And then um, an anonymous pharmacist in Marietta that makes a big difference. She she doesn't like any kind of recognition, but she's awesome. So. My type of people, my type of people. Okay, guys, our Marietta business is showing up, showcasing today. Let's give Charlie a call, 304-295-0792, and Miss Michelle, 304-295-0792. Way too quiet in here. <laughs> Jane, what's up? Hey, we have a ton of people to thank, but we just can't get our VIPs off the phone, which is a really good problem That's to have. That's a great problem. Karen, did you have some folks to thank? I'm, I'm pretty good. Yeah. I'm, okay. I'm all Great, great. Jennifer, are you still on the phone? Do you have some folks to thank? Um, Debbie Hines. Okay. Yep. As an angel donor. Okay. Yep. Thank you. <laughs> I have an angel. Paul Russell just called in for he and Verna. Okay, wonderful. Do you have anyone else to thank? I'm sorry, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> and Ryan, oh, I think the phone. let's catch you up. Oh my goodness! Okay. Uh, the whole time, I want to thank Jason, Tri-State, Ed, uh, Dustin, Bill, Dave, Rock. I mean, just so many people have been so kind and generous, and I just can't thank. I had like four or five post-it notes. We've had all kinds of levels, and just, just blessed. You've been busy. Yes, Absolutely. been blessed. I have Rogers, Rogers fan. I understand. So. I understand. There you go again. Yeah, okay. Thanks. All right, we're gonna head down to Phil. I think Kiki. Yes, Kiki's got another one. I have uh, Van Beha, thank you very much. And I have Angel, Mark, and Donna McGinnis, thank you. Auntie Anne's Pretzels, Chick-fil-A, Perry and Frank Mez, 
Brian, Sofia, Nadia, Nadia, Ayanana Colombo, and Maestro Parade Committee. Thank you very much for all your generosity. We appreciate you very much. All right, thank you, Kiki. And now I'm gonna try to go to Rhonda just really quickly. She's got a couple of people that she'd like to thank before the telethon wraps up, Rhonda. Yes, I do. Thank you so much. I'd like to recognize uh, Zachary Jones in honor of Taylor Noel Jones. And also, uh, um, and if you can come back to me. Please. Oh, sure, sure. Well, I think I'll send it down to Andrew now. Andrew, yes, how's your side got doing? Victoria West here. She's got a couple shout outs. She's been one of the last few phones ringing. Karen Ketcher, thank you so much for making a donation in, um, mo in so honor of and in memory oh, of Mary Lou Alloway. Oh, Dawn um, Johnson called in, no. Roger McPherson called in, in memory of Don Johnson. I appreciate you so much. And um, West Wallace Focus is making a donation. And so is Jaberta White. And Brittany um, and Emily, they called in and made a donation. Oh my gosh. John was trying to answer my phone. <laughs> <laughs> us next year no, no. listen I'll, I'll no. talk to Brandon no. about that but thank you guys if you can get another call and we're about to show the final tote here so Phyllis oh Jane, Brandon Callie, you get it someone in. take it away I don't know who <laughs> Brandon. Someone. Brandon. Someone. okay okay our final tote here we go here we go get it I think we got it <gasps> we can do it. Oh. VIPs, everyone. Yeah. Brandon here too. You're yeah. literally crying. You get on the mic right you now. This, this is all you. So take it away. Three hundred thousand dollars of impact we made in 2024. Thank you to the Mid Ohio Valley for believing in our mission, for believing for everything yeah. that we stand for, yeah. and for providing inclusive opportunities for individuals with intellectual and developmental differences. Have a great evening. Yeah. Thanks to Wood County Society, Camp Echo is held for adults with disabilities each June at Cedar Lakes in Ripley. For over half a century, Camp Echo has provided respite care for families and is an anticipated week for our clients that revolves around inclusion and empowerment by activating minds and passion. As they share in art therapy, experiential activities, cultural entertainment, aquatic therapy, and equine therapy, your contributions to Wood County Society make Camp Echo possible. Rise up today for impact you can see right now. You're watching WTAP. This is home.